assalamu alaikum students this video is for pre 9th class of physics students in last video we discussed the last question in last video was uh, the most important invention in the history of mankind that was wheel students today we will discuss that uh, the wheel rolls rather than slide and uh, that uh, reduces the friction it means that uh, rolling friction is less than sliding friction and students we know that friction is a force that opposes the motion of body and we have discussed in detail that uh, even the smoother surface when we see under the microscope that uh, must has uh, that has uh, bumps and uh, pits and we know that these are called uh, cold wells students when this block is placed on the surface of a table even when we see with naked eye these bottom of the block and upper surface of the table both are both are smooth but when we see under the microscope they both have bumps and pits mean to say that they have rough surfaces clear so these bumps and pits these are called cold wells when we want to bring this block in motion then we have to apply force clear when this will move so if we want to bring this block in motion then we have to break these cold wells clear and if then it will move and if we want to break these cold wells then we have to apply force so it means that that force which we we will apply that is being used against the cold wells or we can say that that force which we are applying is being used against the friction students to bring this block in motion we have to apply more force it means that uh, there is more friction because if we want to bring this block in motion then we have to break the cold wells then we have to apply more force or we can say that uh, there is more friction so in other case when we have a wheel these cold wells again we have bumps and pits in the form of cold wells but in this case the weight of the wheel is downward which is action and its reaction in opposite direction according to newton third law is upward clear so students in this case when we push the wheel wheel starts to move without rupturing the cold weld without rupturing without breaking these cold welds so in, it means that um, in this case in the case of wheel if we want to bring this wheel in motion then we no need to break the cold welds it means that we will apply less force it means that uh, uh, there is less friction clear so that is uh, why that uh, in rolling friction is less than sliding friction because in sliding we have to break the cold welds but uh, in rolling when we roll anything then it starts to move without rupturing without breaking the cold welds hence we can say that rolling friction is smaller than less than sliding friction so in the case of when axle of the wheel you can see in diagram wheel is pushed the force of friction between the wheel and the ground at the point of contact contact provides the reaction force when this wheel start to move in the force between these two points they provide a reaction force the reaction force acts at the contact point of the wheel in a direction opposite to the applied force clear as the reaction of the applied force according to newton third law the wheel rolls without rupturing the cold welds as i have told you and i have shown you before that uh, if in the case of uh, wheel it will start to move without rupturing the cold welds because action and reaction both are equal but in opposite direction that's why rolling friction is much smaller than sliding friction why because i have shown you that in the case of sliding if we want to bring the if we want to move the block over the surface of table then we have to break the cold welds that's why its friction is more but in the case of wheel its rolling friction is less why because 
it start it rolls without rupturing the coal bars that's why rolling friction is much smaller than sliding friction the fact that rolling friction is less than sliding friction is applied in ball bearings as you can see roll bearings to reduce losses due to friction so then that is uh, the answer of why rolling friction is less than sliding friction thank you allah hafiz